At a crowded car show, a Tarpon Springs police officer shooting and killing a suspect right in the middle of the street. ABC Action News reporter Kara Mashik is following this developing story and joins us live right now from downtown Tarpon Springs with what led up to this shooting. Kara? Certainly very scary for everybody that was out here this afternoon. We're right here along Tarpon Avenue. You can see the crime tape still blocking things off and officers investigating right there in the middle of the road where those orange cones are laid out in the small markers. That is where this shooting unfolded, where that suspect was shot and killed. Now, if you are actually capturing some video just moments after the shooting happened, as emergency crews started to surround the suspect and they were trying to save him, several people at the car show apparently saw a man who was riding a bicycle with a hood pulled up over his head. That was kind of strange, and so they told police about it when a Tarpon Springs officer confronted that man. Police say he gave them a fake name. Seconds later, the officer radioed, shots fired. He came at me with a knife. Officers started moving all the witnesses and people nearby away from the scene. And it was pop, 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 pop. And I thought, ooh. And I got up and I looked and I saw the man on the ground and I saw the police officer running down the Pinellas Trail. And they did a phenomenal job because no one else was injured. Now, the suspect was taken to the hospital where he died. His name and the officer's name not being released just yet. FDLE is now investigating the officer's actions. Now, the event here just uh, wrapped up about an hour ago. They did, of course, put things on hold for a while as this whole investigation began, but they picked it back up and tell me they still managed to raise thousands of dollars for cancer research. Live in Tarpon Springs, Karamashik, ABC Action News.